share screen. All right, can you all see my YouTube video there, guys and girls? Oh, no, I've got to stop it because I just realized I didn't share the sound. Did you all see my, my YouTube video come up from there? Penny from Cheshire and Quasi. Good morning. All right, screen number one. Uh, there you go. Can you all see that YouTube video? Yeah, can you all see that YouTube video? All right. I'm just going to play this for like two minutes and then um, we'll get started. If you're watching this right now, I hope this inspires and motivates you. I used to work in a car park for seven years and every day in that job, I was surrounded by my dream cars, cars I could never ever afford. And fast forward just a few years later, I am picking up my brand new dream car. And if you told me this was possible a few years ago, I probably would have laughed in your face. But it shows you that with the right action, with the right vision, and with the right education and knowledge, anything is possible. So I hope you enjoy this video of me collecting my dream car. And I really hope that it inspires and motivates you to go after your goals. Here is a screenshot of my phone background that I had for about a year. So let's see if I made this vision a reality. guys and girls hopefully you found that inspiring and motivating and uh, look, if you want to check out more stuff like that uh check out my youtube channel i've got a lot of amazing content not just all about cars it's really there to help you there's a lot of great great material there so right are we ready are we ready guys and girls all right are we ready we have got an action pack morning for you today and i don't want to delay any further i just want to crack on so oh yeah ready come on right the more you guys give me the more i give you uh some people say can't see my picture Ta -da! here i am in the office on a saturday morning with my mic and i'm super excited uh, because this is probably going to be one of the best sessions I've ever done. Um, I've got my phone here for a bit of social proof. So if we do a little video, uh, welcome. Let's see how we perform in this training. All right, guys. So let's go. So look, picture okay, picture good. Look, you don't need to see this. I've got a face for radio. So I'm going to hide my face. Now I'm going to get to my slides. 
because I am just excited. All right. Are we ready? All right. Share my screen and let me just do a little bit of adjustments, a little bit of adjustments, and then we can get going. All right. Sorry, that was a very bad accent. Ready. Penelope's ready. Okay. Share screen. Desktop one. Let's go. Can you all see my slides, ladies and gentlemen? Can you all see that? How to consistently make 10, 50, 100,000 a month selling digital products with predictability and consistency. Um, excellent. You can all say, yes, yes, yes. Come on. I want to see everybody participating, every single one of you participating in this. So, this is for you if you already have a business and you want more leads, you want more sales, and you want to fully automate the process. This is also for you if you are looking for something that actually gets results, is in high demand, and you can do from home, and it's hugely profitable, like wildly profitable, okay? So that's for you. So does this sound like for the people in the room? I'm sure it does. So look, if you feel like this guy, you are going to love this, okay? If you, does anybody feel like this guy? Anybody feel a bit frustrated like, 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 like this guy, bless him? Yes, yes, yes. I've got my chat open here. Nice to meet. All right, cool. Yes, yes, yes. All right. So look, this is for you if you want to make money from home, if you tried selling online, but it hasn't worked, if you want to create an income online, but you don't want to spend ages building out websites, funnels, sales pages. If you're not technical, this is for you. If you want a passive income, great news. You're in the right place. If you do not know where to start, it's also for you. If you want to create predictable and consistent income from home, that's for you. If your Facebook or Google ads account is restricted or banned or suspended, this is for you. And if you want to pandemic and also future-proof your income, then my friends, you are in the right place because this is going to be for you. All right. So what is this? Everything I'm going to teach you today works for selling online courses, ebooks, affiliate products and services, coaching programs, masterminds, software tools, marketing and done for you services, pretty much any digital product you can think of. Okay. So it works for all of the above. Now, I don't know if you know, but the e learning space is climbing to 325 billion over the next three years or so. So Look, what this means is that people are selling digital products online. People are spending more and more time at home, at social distance, creating, sourcing, flipping digital products, okay? Um, I don't know about you, but over the last year, I have spent so much time at home and it's been the best thing ever. So the question is, how much of that pie would you guys like? Let me know on a percentage wise, how much of that piece of that $325 billion pie would you like? Let me know in the chat. Come on. You know, 1%, 1 billion. I love it. Love it. All right. 1%. Yeah. 1% Jerry says, come on. Listen, the more you guys give me, the more I give you. If you're going to be flat, listen, we might as well shut up shop and go home. 100K would be nice. All right, come on, come on, where's, where's everyone going? 10%, all right, all right, come on, come on, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Right, so look, guys, as you know, I used to work in a car park. I did this for seven years. And when you use old tactics, it can really destroy your income. Look, I made seven pounds in 18 months struggling on my own using old tactics. And you can see there's a screenshot. Back in 2014, I sold my first ever digital product uh, and it was just like a painful experience. Really, 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 really painful. So look, who wants to receive completely passive notifications like this? You know, two, three thousand pounds a month from one product, another thousand from another product, another five thousand from another product. Come on, everybody play it. Say me if you want to receive notifications like this on your phones, on your emails, on a daily, weekly, monthly basis. Come on. We have got over 80 people on here. I want at least 40 comments. Let's blow up that chat, guys and girls. Blow it up, blow it up. I'm here 
teaching you. And if you can't even be bothered to type in a little comment on there, I'm sorry, you should just log off because you ain't going to be successful at this stuff. I'm going to give it to you raw. I'm not going to fluff it up. I'm going to tell you what you need to hear, not what you want to hear. Right. Amazing. Hell yeah. Come on. Good. So that's just a few of my, I call these side hustles, right? These are side hustles. You want to get a, let me get to the main good stuff. On a bad week, it's about four grand. On, a, on an average week, it's about 16 grand. On a good week, it's 30,000 pounds. Yes, 30,000 pounds. And here's more screenshots of you. You can see there, uh, the week ending Friday, the 1st of October, we did 33,000 straight into my bank account. Thank you very much. Literally a week later, we've got another 22,000 available to pay out. Thank you very much. So look, whether you want to make that, that by the way, that 94,000 pounds is from one digital product. One, thank you. Helen says, wow. Listen, it is not hard, guys and girls. If a guy like me can do it that used to work in a park, car park, each and every one of you can do it too. So this is where the money's at. Now, look, I yes, I've been very successful, but I also remain very, very, very humble. So my brand is called clientandconsulting.com. Go and check it out. Um, I'll place the links in the description. Uh, also, in fact, now's probably a good time. So if you want to follow me on Instagram, um, Facebook and YouTube uh, as well, I will give you those links towards the end as well. Now, we have won several awards. So we won 10K and 30 day awards, 50K and 30 days, 100K in 30 days, and over a million sales online. Now, let me ask you guys a question. If you could pick one of those awards in the next 30 days, thank you, Helen. And look, I'm not showing this to impress you and look at how amazing I am. I'm not amazing, okay? Which one of these three awards would you guys like? 10K in 30 days, 50K in 30 days, or 100K in 30 days in the next 30 days? Because look, this is something I do day in, day out. And I'm going to show you exactly how I do this in this training. So you're going to want to pay close attention. Come on. Like what? Like where's all the people gone? We've only got five entries, six entries. I want everyone to play. Come on. How much money do you want to make? If you don't want to make money, get off this webinar. This is not for you. If you're too lazy to even type in the comments, this is not for you. Come on. Amazing. All right. We've got different entries, 10Ks, 50Ks, 30Ks, 100Ks. All right, because the truth is, I can help you do any one of those. Uh, Jacqueline says a million. Great, let's do a million. Can it be done in the next 30 days? It can, but it depends on the size of your audience. All right, come on, everybody play along. How much do you want? Don't let your limiting beliefs stop you. Oh, I can't do it. The reason you can't do it is because you haven't worked with me yet. That's the truth. Every single one of my clients makes money without a shadow of a doubt. All right, good, 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 good. All right, I'm loving it. So look, that's the kind of stuff I have a knowledge, experience, and a blueprint and a system that you can achieve, okay? All your job is to implement. Brilliant. I'm loving these comments. Woo! Lighten up the chat. Lighten up the chat here, guys and girls. Absolutely loving it. Now, obviously, this gives me a very, 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 nice lifestyle. So, you know, I have a wife, I have two beautiful children, my wife hasn't worked in how many years, we get to travel. Next year, I'm retiring my mum, which to me is one of my greatest achievements to retire my mum. And honestly, retiring her is more important than anything else that you've ever seen from me. Uh, because it's just such a nice personal goal. And I can't wait to do that. All right. So which one are you? Like, which one are you guys? Are you giving up too soon? The, the person down below. Are you hustling too hard? You're attending every bloody webinar. You're doing everything, but you're just not kind of getting there. Or are you working smart? Because you see, if you use the right tools, the right people, and the right opportunities around you, you can make this happen, all right? Without a shadow of a doubt. This isn't some kind of magic blueprint that only people know that know how to do magic. No, this is, everybody can do this. So what we're gonna to cover today, number one, how to achieve more in 30 days than in the last 12 months, okay? You're gonna achieve more in the next 30 days than in the last 12 months. How to become clear on your offer, okay? And clarity on what you're selling. 
the four keys to explode your business, and you'll see how easy that is, the success triangle. Now, the success triangle is just absolute gold. You, you're going to love it. And who wants to live the millionaire lifestyle without having a million in pound in the bank? That's what we're going to cover as secret number five as well. All right, a little sip of my coffee and let's go. So if you're struggling to generate leads, you cannot get your ads to convert. You're no good at copywriting. You're struggling to automate your business. You cannot think of good social media content ideas. You have a lack of uh, time to grow your business, bad at selling, no tech skills, and cannot drive traffic. This is for you, ladies and gentlemen. So let's get into it. So you're ready to start a business, okay? You want to start a business. You're excited. You're like, yeah, man, like this is going to be amazing. This is you. Ooh, I am super excited. I'm going to be rich. I'm going to be rich. So you are convinced that you can do this without any professional help. So what do you do? You go to Google and you go to YouTube and you try and Google and YouTube your way to success. Okay. All right. Hello, 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 hello. Are you back in the room? Am I back in the room? Can you guys hear me? Lost you. I'm back. Yes. Uh, amazing. See, you don't even need to be good at tech. Your tech can fail and you can still be good at this stuff. All right. So let me share my screen again. There we go. Desktop one. Boom. All right. Are we back with the little baby in the, in the, in the seat? Yeah. Amazing. 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 Okay, cool. So look, this was me. There was a lot of buttons to press. And I'm like, look, I will figure this out. I'm smart. You know, I can do it. Google and YouTube, you can do everything, blah, 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 blah. And then what happens is I turn, you know, a lot older. And this is just a metaphor. So this is now like my, you know, my digital age. And it's like, I'm nearly there now, just a little bit more. And this baby is taken to the skies. Now, what's the biggest problem with that? Well, the biggest problem with that is, would it not be smarter to hire professional help to tell you which buttons to press? Like, what's more important to you guys? Price of something or the results and whether or not it actually works? Let me know. Price or results? What's more important, the price or the results? Let me know in the chat. All right, results, results, results. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We want to keep this interactive. All right. Cool. Yeah, of course, it's the results. And you, you, you all understand because the thing is, look, Warren Buffett once said that, you know, Warren Buffett, one of the richest investors in the world, he says, I can buy anything I want, but I can't buy time. And ladies and gentlemen, you've got to understand something. The more time, the longer it takes you to achieve whatever you want to achieve, not necessarily financially, it can be, you know, spiritually, relationship wise, health wise, you are paying the ultimate price of your time. Every minute, every second that goes by is gone forever, ever, okay? Um, so I'm gonna talk to you about your two biggest expenses in life. So who knows the two biggest, who knows, this, who knows the biggest expense in life? Like, let me know in the chat. What do you think is the biggest expense in life? Let me know. I, I love hearing this stuff because, you know, um, at the end of the day, we all have ex different expenses. So what is your biggest expense? Oh, okay, someone says home, getting married, my kids, <laughs> time, car, women. Um, come on, house. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right, 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 right. Uh, we've got tax, we've got mortgage, kids, children, divorce, moving, lifestyle, 
blah, 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 home, taxes, blah, 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 blah. Well, all right. Food, breathing. I love it. Well, listen, it costs nothing to breathe, Mick. So you're good on that one. Christine says her mortgage, car and taxes. Mortgage, blah, blah, blah. I don't know what the deal is with mortgages. My mortgage isn't really that expensive. Anyway, so look, it, the answer is none of those things. I'm going to start with the second biggest thing. Your second biggest expense in life is taxes. Okay, let me explain. If you earn a gross salary, so before tax, so before the government takes their little cut of £50,000, if your employer, if your job, if your business earns £50,000 a year, you actually pay 50% tax over your lifetime. And you're going to say, no, I don't, Stas. No, 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 no. I, I, I'm in the lower tax bracket. No, 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 no. I only pay 20%. Well, you see, the government is so smart They've hidden how you pay tax because you pay tax when you earn money. You pay tax when you spend that money. You pay tax when you buy food. You pay tax when you put your petrol in your car. You pay tax when you buy a house. You pay tax when you sell a house. So guess what? Over the course of your life, the average Brit or the average person in, you know, you, in the UK, in America, Canada will pay 50% tax over your lifetime. So actually, you're only making 25 grand a year if you earn 50 grand a year. See, the government is so clever. They've hidden that tax cost so you don't know. But do you know what the amazing thing is? That's not even your biggest cost. Like, that's not even your biggest cost in life. Imagine now, you earn 250,000 a year. You're a high rate earner, all right? And great. So now you only earn 125,000 because again, the government pay or take 50% of your money. So there you go, 100 grand. Now, that's not even the single biggest expense. You know what the single biggest expense in your life is? It's not knowing. It's not knowing how to make 50 grand, 250 grand, whatever it may be. So let me explain. Let's just imagine you want to earn a hundred grand a year, okay? Well, taxes, yeah, you're actually earning 50 grand, but this is the maths. If you're earning, say, 25,000 a year or whatever it is, you are paying life 75,000 pounds a year every year that goes by that you don't know how to make a hundred grand. And that is your biggest cost not knowing. If you want to make a million pound a year and you currently make a hundred grand a year, you are paying life 900 grand a year. So before you start rambling on about, oh, well, it's too expensive. I can't afford it. You can't afford, you can't afford to not know because life is too short. Okay. So, and the reason I know I did, I did this. Look, I was a freepreneur. Okay. I'm claiming that I invented this term because you've never heard of this anywhere. Like who is a freepreneur? A freepreneur is someone who tries to Google and YouTube their way to millions. I did this for two and a half years, guys and girls. Two and a half years of my freaking life, I wasted on Googling and YouTubing because I thought, oh, I'm saving money here. Yeah, I I I'm not going to pay for any programs or courses because oh, yeah, I could do it all myself. Well, I made seven pounds. Seven freaking pounds. Safe to say... I wasn't ready to hand in my notice at that point, all right? One year salary for me back then was around 15,000 pounds. Two and a half years meant I wasted 37 and a half thousand pounds trying, trying to figure it out without any professional help. And then as soon as I got help, nine months later, I made a hundred grand. So which one would you rather? Would you rather pay for help and in nine months reach your income goal at the time or would you rather struggle on your own for years, but you're saving money, you're not going to be, you know, uh, spending any money on that. Blah, 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 blah. So that one was free. That was a bonus lesson on me. All right. So secret number one, how to fast track your income in 30 days. Now, look, if you feel like this guy, I get it. Because when people start to build their companies, and their businesses and their online ventures, they try to do a million things at once. They try to do Instagram, Facebook, Pinterest, YouTube ads, Clubhouse, and all this other stuff because they've seen a YouTube video, they've 
seen a, in a Facebook group or whatever. They've got to be doing all this stuff. But if you try to do everything at once, you will achieve, like you won't achieve anything. You will just become overwhelmed, like absolutely overwhelmed with this stuff. And this is the circle of focus. You see, if you draw a circle in the middle of a page and you put all the things that you are focusing on right now to grow your business, to grow your income, let's just imagine it was Facebook ads, podcasts, interviews, YouTube, Pinterest, and a blog. That is six things, okay? Six things. Now, if you divide 100 by six, this means that you are giving 16% attention to everything now i don't know about you can you please all answer me this question have you ever met anyone achieving success that gives less than a hundred percent attention to what they're doing ever have you ever met anyone that's been able to do that like do you think it's possible to achieve success doing 16 percent attention to whatever it is you're trying to do come on so look do this right now, draw a circle, write down all the things you're focusing on and work out your percentage. Just do 100 divided by the number of segments that you have in your circle. So if your circle looks like a pizza, my friend, you are in trouble. You're in trouble and you'll never get anything done or, you know, unless you do one thing at a time. Okay, unless you do one thing at a time. Now, let me show you how you can do one thing at a time because to tell you the truth, it's not that hard. So here's your circle of focus, okay? And over here is your to-do list. So let's say that Facebook groups was the first thing you wanted to, what needed to do in your business. You're gonna put Facebook groups in that circle of focus and nothing else, nothing else. And you are gonna focus on that and getting that up to speed until it's done. If it takes you an hour, great. If it takes you a day, so be it. A week, oh well. A month, good. But at least it will be done and you would have mastered that subject. You then move that out of the circle of focus in your done list over here. And then guess what? You put the next thing in. And I promise you, if you stick to this religiously over the next 30 days, you will get more done than the, net, the last 12 months because it just dawned on me the other day, it's bloody Christmas very, very soon. And it feels like I've only celebrated New Year. It's unbelievable. So instead, focus on one thing at a time, master it, and then delegate it. And when each task is complete, you can remove it from your circle of focus and then focus on the next task, okay? Now, I'm going to go one step further. and I'm going to show you something else as well. You see, I have an amazing accountability planner system that I have developed. And this is what it looks like. I spend, well, 30 minutes a day and I have Sundays off. When I'm looking to launch any new digital product to 100K, this is the system that I follow. So let's have a look. Week one, we create the goals for the week. Create an irresistible offer and choose a product to sell. And then I've got tasks that takes me 30 minutes a day on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And guess what? On Sundays, I relax and I go to the park with the kids. I go to church and do all that other stuff with my family. Week two, set up multiple traffic systems and payment systems. Great. And I have a 30-minute task that I do every single day. And then that is done. Then I go to week three, drive high-quality traffic to my sales page on autopilot. I've got two kids, y'all. I'm busy. <laughs> I ain't got time to be sitting around. I need things automated. And then boom, 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 boom. 30 minutes a day, I am up and running. Week four, analyzing conversion rates and sales. And then I celebrate my win. So I look at how much money I made by the end of week four. I analyze everything and see what's working and what can be removed. And then week five, I remove any underperforming elements and automate the system completely. And then that product pretty much goes on autopilot. And so let me just show you. Right. You remember this screenshot? You remember this? There we go. 94,000 pounds using that action accountability planner. So let me ask you guys a question. Here it is. Do you, would you guys like a copy of this action planner? 
Would you guys like a copy of this action plan? Say, who would like a copy of my exact steps? Let me know in the chat, because if you don't want it, listen, it's cool, you ain't got to have it. By the way, this sells for round about 500 pounds on its, on its own. So if you want that and like, okay, great. Come on, who's playing? Because guess what I'm going to do? I'm going to go over every single comment that said, yes, please, yes, sure, why not? So on and so forth. And then I might just send it to you. But I'm going to show you, I'm going to tell you how you can get your hands on it uh, very, very shortly. Anyway, so don't worry. All right, cool. Uh, somebody says, how did I come up with this planner? And Curry, once you've made millions online, it, it, there's no guesswork. It's like, I know what to do. I know what to do. I know how long it takes. And I know when you need to do it. So I came up with it myself. Um, so, all right. So we have a lot of people want this. As I said, the value of this is about 500 pounds. I probably might even double it to a thousand soon because we do sell this on its own because look, everybody has got 30 minutes a day. Okay. You're never going to struggle alone if you have this and you can have Sundays off to do whatever the hell you like. So the truth is you don't need to do everything at once. You don't need to be on every social media platform and you don't need to run ads on every social media platform either. Okay. So the way you get more stuff done is you have a circle of focus. You have your to-do list. And look, if you have something like an accountability action planner, well, that's just an icing on a cake. That's just a bonus. Okay. That's just a bonus because look, if you have something like that, it just means that you're going to get there so much faster. All right. So, so, so much faster. Okay. Moving on. So number one is circle of focus, to-do list with your priority, and then the accountability planner, if you can. Number two, secret number two is becoming, becoming clear on, excuse me, let me get my mouse in the right place, becoming clear on your offer. Now, just to be very, very clear with you guys and girls, an offer is your product or service that you sell in the marketplace. So an offer is a product or service that you sell in the marketplace. Now, let me know in the chat, what is it that you guys and girls sell? Like, what is it that you guys and girls sell? Let me know in the chat right now. I want to know exactly what you guys sell. So let me know, what's your offer? What is your product or service um, in the marketplace? And if you sell nothing, then put nothing. Um, come on. I want everyone to play along. So we've got a few people said nothing, uh, accommodation, books, uh, courses, nothing yet, nothing, 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 uh, cookware, uh, digital courses. Okay, so keep going, keep going. I want, uh, so we've got some eBay stuff, affiliate products, nothing, digital course. Wow, okay, cool. Nothing, nothing, nothing. So all the people that said nothing, would you like me to give you something to sell? Like, like if I give you something to sell, how would that, how would that be? Would that be good? Would you guys like that? Um, all righty. So, cause I've got something very, very special for you. Yes, please. Yes, please. Blah, 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 blah. All right, cool. So you probably, most people, when they dream of making money online, this is what they do. I'm going to show you. This is so funny. So you start telling everyone about your thing. You start telling everyone about your course, your program, your, you know, wh whatever it is that you sell. And this is you. You start telling all these people and you say, hey, 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 buy my stuff, buy my stuff. It's really good. I have this course on social media. I have this course on this. I have this course on that. Blah, 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 blah. You know, uh, accommodation, whatever it is, eBay, whatever it is, you sell affiliate products. And people are like, I ain't interested, my friend. Keep it moving. Go away. Now, most people do this. Then see what happens is you do this, right? You start telling everyone about it and then nothing works. Oh, all right, I know. The secret must be, let me run some ads because ads are definitely the system that's going to help me make this work, right? Ads are really, really, really going to help me. Well, you run an ad to buy my stuff. <clears throat> Same outcome. Well, there's a few ways that you're making a big, big, big mistake and let me show you see this is the old guru way okay this is the old guru way of doing things so 
What do I mean? Well, this is a popular way to sell products via an automated generic webinar, but it's so complicated and it's so long-winded and it doesn't work. Let me show you how. Well, the first thing is a client will see your ad. And then the next thing is they will go to your landing page, which is full of fluff and rubbish. They will then get taken to a confirmation page after they have registered for your webinar. And then they will pick a time to join the webinar because you're pretending it's a live webinar when every human being on this planet Earth knows that live webinars are not ran every 15 minutes. So I don't know why people do that. It's just stupid. Then they receive numerous reminder emails about your amazing webinar. They then log in and they wait for the webinar to start in your waiting room, kind of like how you guys were waiting in the waiting room here to get into um, this, uh, this presentation. And then eventually, oh my goodness me, when they've turned 76, and they because they were about 25 when they saw your ad, by the time they've got here, they're about 76, they've celebrated all their birthdays, and they, then they finally get to watch the webinar. And then the client goes to an order page or registers for a call or whatever, and it's like, oh my gosh, this is so long-winded. Like, and with the traditional method, you're going to get so many issues because you're going to get more support tickets. People will not be able to join the webinar. People will forget. And because there's so much technology involved, then what that means is there's more things that can go wrong. There's more things that can break. There's more things that are likely to happen. Now, let me show you about the no BS stats way. See, because I'm very, very much a no BS kind of guy. So let's simplify the process. Client sees your ad. They go to your landing page. They get taken directly to your webinar. No confirmation page. No waiting room. No nothing like that. And then they go straight to the order page. I half the process in half. There's no confirmation emails. There's no picking a time. And the video is available instantly because everyone knows that most webinars, 99% of them are pre-recorded and they are not done live. So people's attention spans are lower today than ever before. And this, my friends, is shrinking. This, my friends, is shrinking, okay? So stop using the guru way that is just long and just doesn't work and start using the no BS stats way that does work, all right? Now, I wanna see if how well you know. For the people that sell something, can you please tell me what it is that you sell? Like, oh, no, 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 you've already told me. No, 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 let's start again. Imagine, let me, let me, let me paint a, a picture for you. Um, you are meeting the parents' dinner. So you have a new partner and you come to meet the parents' dinner. And you're sitting down, you're having dinner with them. Everything's wonderful. And they ask you, what is it you do for a living? How would you describe that with the thing that you're selling online right now? So for the people that sell stuff online right now, please let me know what it is that uh, you say. Come on. <laughs> we had at least five or 10 people that sold something. So whether it's a digital course, whether it's affiliate marketing, whether it's uh, accommodation, whatever it is, please tell me how you answer this question. Come on. Cool. The chat's gone really silent. It's like tumbleweed. It's like... It's like, <laughs> what do you do for a living? Online marketing. What do you do for a living? My abstract mural paintings. Is that it? Is that, is that the only two entries? We've only got two entries, guys. Come on. So what do you do? Oh, get rid of that for a second. I do digital marketing. Oh, okay. Right. Anything else? Internet marketing. Oh, I'm an online marketing specialist. I giving people time and money. Okay. Sounds like a very generous offer. Uh, Eco-friendly and budget-friendly cookware, translation, cookware, Amazon FBA, solution to problem. <laughs> I love it. Online business development. All right. Okay, cool. And at that point, guys and girls, I love it. I have the best self-catering accommodation in Johannesburg, Joburg, that I sell on short-term rental basis. Okay, that's a bit better, Louisa. That's a bit better. Everyone else, at that point, I would, I would, I mean, I wouldn't be confused, but I'll just be like, you do digital marketing, that's great. You do cookware, you do Amazon FBA, you do online business development. 
boring. You haven't got my attention. You haven't got my attention, okay? And if you haven't got my attention, I'm sorry, then, right. Let me show you how to get clarity. You see, you all need to get a core marketing statement. What is a core marketing statement? Well, I'm gonna show you. Remember, this is the most important thing that you need to do when you're creating your offer. Your offer is your product and service to the marketplace. You see, all of you that said whatever you just do right now, you've just put yourself in a commodity product. Everyone sells digital courses. So you're competing on price. It's a race to the bottom. Now, your mission statement should fit into this sentence. I help market get desire without old belief by method. And your method is from this, you can add your products, but it must be something that helps them execute the method. So you don't put your product there, you put the method there, okay? The vehicle that's gonna help them get there. So let's give you some examples. I help new dads, that's my market. My market is new dads. Lose the dad body, that's their desire. New dads don't want to be known as the dad bod. They don't want to be known as Peppa, uh, Daddy Pig from Peppa Pig. I, I was known as Daddy Pig from Peppa Pig when I first started having kids because I started getting the dad body. So I wanted to lose that dad body. But guess what? I wanted to do it without sacrificing my favorite foods. And that was an old belief of mine. I thought, well, look, if I am going to ever lose this dad body, I've got to sacrifice pizza and burgers and takeaways and Indian and Chinese and all this other stuff. Ah, oh, what's the new method? Intermittent fasting. Ooh, that's interesting. You see, that's got my attention. Guess what this does? This attracts the right audience. New dads, that's your market. If you ain't a new dad, this ain't for you, my friend. If you ain't a new mum, this ain't for you, my friend. If your desire is not to lose the dad body, this ain't for you. If your desire isn't to get fit, uh, to, to have a beach body, this ain't for you. Without sacrificing their favorite food by implementing, uh, by intermittent fasting, sorry. Let's do another one. So if you want to lose weight faster, easier, more efficiently, then my product is what helps them execute the method. Thank you, Susan. There's bound to be some spelling mistakes in my spelling. Um, I do never claim to be perfect English. In fact, English is my second language, but hey, hey ho, see? Proof again that you can be bad at tech, you can be pretty stupid, you can misspell stuff, and you can still make money. Uh, Susan, I, I, I'd even do a bet with you that there's bound to be more in my presentation. In fact, let's see how many more, right? All right, so you have to get the customer, which is your market, to believe that the only way to get their desire is through your method. Let me say that again. You have to get the customer to believe that the only way to get their desire is through your method. And once you get them to believe that, then you can sell them the product that allows them to execute on that method, okay? Mia, my first language is Russian. Um, so, you need to make your market believe that in order to achieve their desire without their old belief, they need to do your method, okay? So if you believe your method, then you can sell them whatever you want. So if they believe your method, you can sell them whatever you want as long as it makes the desire easier to achieve. So if you don't follow this one key, this could be why your business is not successful and why it doesn't seem to be working. Once you make your marketing statement and make all your business revolve around that statement, then everything will fall into place. So remember, market, desire, old belief, and method. So, all right, all right, we've got Andrew Milburn with an entry here. I work with individuals, businesses, and charities. Do you mind if I pick on you, Andrew? Like, when I say pick on you, I'm going to give you some constructive criticism. Listen, anything I say to you guys is never meant against you personally. I'm telling you the truth because I want to help you. And I, and I just know how much fluff there is out there. And you guys are just eating fluff on a daily basis and you believe in it. And that's what really pisses me off. All right, refer. Uh, so I work, So Andrew's got an entry. And if anyone else wants to give me an entry, by the way, for me to test, um, by all means, fire away. So 
first of all, round of applause for Andrew for even like, you know, he's, he's committed, he's taking action. This is what I love. I work with individuals, businesses, and charities to start and build their eBay businesses so they can turn unwanted items into much needed cash. Okay. Now, it's okay. Well, look, it's not good, but it's a good effort. Okay. I'll be honest with you. Because the first problem is I work with individuals. You see, the problem with working with individuals, you're going to attract uh, broke individuals. You're going to attract individuals that don't want to do this. You're going to attract, you know, every kind of individual. It's not specific enough. If you help everyone, you help no one. The other issue is businesses and charities. All right, look, charities is fine because that's pretty clear. But businesses, there are so many different types of businesses. What kind of business is it? Is it a SME? Is it a local business? Is it a service-based business? Is it a product-based business? Is it a, a, a startup business? Is it an experience business? You see, you can get so much more specific. The other thing is, what's their desire? Their desire probably isn't to build an eBay business. Okay, The eBay business is your method of execution, Andrew. What their desire is, is to, you know, um, to inject much needed cash into their business. That's their desire without, you know, overwhelming and blah, 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 whatever it is by selling unwanted items. Boom, something like that. All right, we've had another entry. I work with local manufacturers who want to make a difference. Listen, um, I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing your name uh, wrong, Lorena. That's just fluff. That doesn't mean anything. Like, want to make a difference? Like, please tell me what the hell that even means. I want to make a difference too. That doesn't mean anything. It's just fluff. Okay? Stop being fluffy, guys and girls. I'll tell you what you need to be, okay? You need to be, number one, desirable. Number two, it's got to be measurable. Number three, it's got to be statable. Two, no, it's not to host the palace. It's got to go to everyone. There we go. There you go. Uh, so I, I work with local manufacturers who want to make a difference by bringing back ancestral traditions which can fit our modern world. Look, I'm sorry. Um, and again, I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name, Lorena. I get this all the time. You can imagine with my name, right? That doesn't mean that's just fluff. Like that's just wishy-washy, fluffy McFlufferson. And if I saw that, I'd be like, yeah, okay, cool. Um, send me an email. <laughs> send me an email. Like that's fluff. I'm sorry to say it's fluff. Let me give you one. Okay, let me give you one. Let me give you one. I help online entre. In fact, let me write it out so you don't hear it. Um, Uh, da, 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 da. Last time. <laughs> Thank you, Hugh. Thank you. Uh -huh. I'm, sure. I'm just typing this out. Over. Here's one example. I help online entrepreneurs start and scale a six-figure online business within 90 days without overwhelm or fluff. Now, can you see the difference between my one and your ones? Like, it's nothing but fluff, guys. I'm sorry. What do I do? Who do I help? Online entrepreneurs. If you ain't an online entrepreneur, this ain't for you, which I think we have over 110 online entrepreneurs on the line right now. What do you want to do? You want to start and scale a six-figure business. If you already have a six-figure business, this is not for you, okay? If you don't have a six business, so, sorry, six-figure business, this is for you. If you want to achieve it within 90 days, that's the tangible, measurable goal without overwhelm or fluff. Uh, Jacqueline says, what's my method? That's a secret. I will reveal to you that very, very soon. Um, cool. Sometimes, look, sometimes you can just have, I help uh, market get desire without old way or belief. And you can just leave it there like that. You can just leave it like that. You know, you don't always have to reveal your method, but it helps. Um, I bring back traditions in our kitchen. No, 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 it's not better, Lorraine. I'm sorry. It's just fluff. Like, I don't want to bring back traditions in my kitchen. Like, no, no, it's got to be more measurable, tangible, desirable. Like, what the hell does that even mean? 
only you know what that means, traditions in our kitchen. Like, I don't understand it. I don't get it. I don't get it. Anyway, um, we're going to move on. Otherwise, we're going to be here forever. So uh, my product always allows you to do exercise more easily and prevent injury in your own home. It's not bad, uh, but it doesn't really kind of fit the sentence. Um, you know, it's not bad. I'm loving it. We're getting like a, a little brainstorming session going here. All right. Listen, guys, I'm going to move on because look, but, but, but key number one, okay, is you've got to be clear on what you sell. And the way you do that is you pass the dinner table test. Okay. Just do the dinner table test. Imagine it's meet the parents dinner and they lean over and ask you, what is it you do for a living? If you can't answer that question clearly, precisely, and get their curiosity hooked, you ain't got clarity in what you do. And if you don't have clarity in what you do, your prospects, your customers are never going to have clarity in what you do. So let me, so if, imagine meet the parents dinner. They ask me, what is it you do, Stas? I help online entrepreneurs start and scale a six-figure business within 90 days without getting overwhelmed or fluffed. Ah, okay. So how do you do that then? And, you know, what's the, you know, what does that involve? Ah, I've got the curiosity hooked. Bait, fish, blah, 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 gone. All right, let's keep it moving. So that's secret number one. Uh, sorry, secret number two. Uh, secret number three is how to explode your business in four moves. Now, let me know in the chat, can you all remember four things? Now, we've got over 100 people, so I want to see a minimum of 50 comments. Can you remember four things? Give me a number four in the chat. Press number four on your keyboard and press enter if you can remember four things. I want 50 entries. If we don't get 50 entries, I'm just going to skip past this because you guys ain't interested. Come on. I want everybody to play along. Everybody hit number four on your keyboards or wherever you're watching this on your phone or wherever. And I want you to give me a number four in the chat. Come on. And I'm going to count. I'm going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come on, number four. Give me a four. Four. Hey, Penelope Smart. She's putting five entries. <laughs> Come on, guys. If you are on this webinar right now and you are not participating and you're not willing to type in the number four because you think, oh, Stas is just being difficult and to say, get off the webinar. I don't even want you here because I'm here to teach you. I ain't here to give you fluff. All right. If you can't be bothered to type before, get off. Get off the webinar. This isn't for you. All right, give me a number four if you want to learn, if you can remember four things that can explode your business. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Yes, there we go. 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 All right, amazing, amazing. All right, Louisa, I will cover, uh, I will recap all the secrets um, at the end. Secret number two was becoming clear on your offer. Just so you know, secret number one was fast tracking your income within 30 days using a circle of focus using a priority list and using a step-by-step -step system that I have, all right? So, uh, right, four keys to grow your business. Amazing. I think we've definitely got over 450 uh, entries, so we'll keep it moving. And by the way, for those of you that, you know, we've lost a couple of people, that's okay. For those of you that aren't really interested in growing and learning and making more money, that's, that's fine. Like, honestly, we're still friends. I still love you. We'll happily go for a drink with you, but... Look, I want to keep it interactive, okay? And hopefully this is refreshing to you rather than, you know, feeding you fluff. So the first thing you got to do is you got to increase the number of leads per month, okay? Who can tell me how many leads their business generated last month? Anyone tell me? Can anyone tell me how many, business, how many leads they generate, their business generated last month? Let me know in the chat. Wow, okay, Jerry says 10, only three, one, none, two. Okay, cool. All right, look, well, you got some, some numbers there, okay? Well, there's your first problem. You see, uh, four, three, three, okay, cool. So there's your first problem. You're generating like five, you're generating like less than 10 leads a month. That's probably why you're not rich yet, okay? Because not enough people are seeing your content. Not enough people are seeing what it is that you're offering. Number two, you got to increase your conversion rate. But the problem is, oh, Andrew's in the lead. He's got 15. Oh, by the way, if you don't have a business, don't worry. Okay, don't worry. Because look, if you implement these four things, I promise you, you will become rich. 
Number four is increase your conversion rate. Okay, and I'm going to show you how you can do each and every one of these. Number three is create a high ticket offer. Conversion rate zero of Jerry at the minute. Number four is create a continuity offer, which is a membership offer. Okay, so how do you increase leads per month? Uh, let me tell you guys the story. Imagine I am, let's pick, I don't know, everybody knows, uh, you know, Oxford, okay? Imagine I am, an, uh, you know, the beautiful city of Oxford and Kingsley says, can you make it work from Nigeria? Yeah, Kingsley, this works anywhere around the world, my friend. Doesn't matter what country you're in. It even works in Russia, believe it or not. Anyway, so Andrew, what do you sell? So your conversion rate is about what? Over 50%, if I'm, if I'm correct? You generated 15 leads and you got eight sales. Anyway, how do you generate more leads? Let me tell you a story. Imagine I'm standing on the high street a corner and I'm handing out 50 pound notes to everybody that walks past and I'm trying to hand them out. What's your first thought? Come on, guys, let me know. What's your first thought? If I'm on a high street corner and I'm handing out 50 pound notes, what is your first thought that comes to your mind? Okay, somebody says, what's the catch? Wasting money, it's fake, weird. What's the catch? What's the catch? Uh, dodgy. Uh, listen, fake money, fake. Yeah, listen, I won't be offended. You can call me any name you want under the sun. Weird and dodgy. You have money to burn. Uh, they are play money. Yep, 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 yep. Cool. You, you are off your, you're off your head, mate. Uh, too good to be true. I, once, I was once handed a fake £20 note by someone Take it, what's to lose, dealer, <laughs> either fake or nutter, difficult to determine the action is genuine or fake. Yeah, exactly. So you don't trust me. The moral of the story is you do not trust me. So you see, and what about if I was standing on the same high street corner and you were riding your bicycle and you're riding your bicycle and a car cuts you up and you fall, you hit your head on the ground, you're bleeding, you're dizzy, like, would you let me call an ambulance using your phone? Would you let me uh, give you some water and move you to the side? Yes or no? Give me a yes or no, guys and girls. Yes or no? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, you all would. Oh, but what changed? I'm exactly the same person, but instead of handing out 50 pound notes now, um, I'm actually helping you get away from pain. Look, the people that said no, get over yourselves. You would let me help you because if you're bleeding, you're dizzy, you've just you know hit your head on a pavement, you would let anybody help you, okay? So like get over your pride, honestly. You would let me help you. You would let any stranger help you when you're in pain. So anyway, the, what's, the, what's, the, what's the moral of the story? I was unconscious. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Listen, what's the moral of the story? The moral of the story is, when you're trying to generate leads, you've got to stop leading people into a pleasurable state. What does that mean? You see, as kids, we're all, say, we're all told, don't trust a stranger. Don't, trust, don't take candy from a stranger. Don't take sweets from a stranger. Don't get lifts from a stranger. In other words, do not take a pleasurable outcome from a stranger. So when you're out there advertising or you're creating your lead magnets and you're saying the three-step system to make 100 grand a day, the three-step system on how you can make a six, have a six-pack next week. The three-step system, blah, blah. Nobody trusts you. Nobody trusts you. And it's okay, guys, because nobody trusts me either. This for a cold audience. Remember, when you want to increase your leads, it's a cold audience. It's cold. They don't know you. They don't trust you. So stop leading them into pleasure. Start leading them away from pain. So what does that mean? Avoid these three mistakes every entrepreneur makes unless you want your business to dry up faster than the Sahara Desert. Avoid these seven foods unless you want to look like Santa Claus before Christmas. Avoid these three dating one-liners unless you want to remain single for the rest of your life. You want to lead people away from pain. That's how you, um, that's how you, uh, um, you know, generate more leads, okay? So stop leading people uh, into pleasure and start leading them away from pain. Second thing is, how do you increase your conversions? I'm gonna ask you guys a question. What is, for those of you that sell something, affiliate, whether it's your own product, it doesn't matter, a service, what is the outcome of what you sell? 
What is the outcome? What is the result of what you sell? Please tell me. Somebody please tell me what is the outcome of what you sell. Oh, I'm going to... Uh, okay, Helen, income is BS. That doesn't mean anything. Like, what do you mean income? Oh, the outcome of what I sell is income. No, it isn't. More toned body. Yeah, okay. It's, it's, it's one step up from Helen, but it ain't much better, Penelope. I'm sorry. Keeping it real. Customer satisfaction. Oh, you can put me to sleep here, guys. And how funny. You all want to be rich, but three of you profit. Oh, love it. That's such a, such a really good, tangible word there, isn't it? <laughs> Easy, painless abs. A good night's rest. That's a bit better, but providing value. What the hell does that even mean, David? Oh, Dave, sorry. Oh, guys. Listen, no wonder you ain't rich. No wonder. Because you're leading people into pleasure and then you're selling something that's not even tangible or measurable. Okay, so let me show you something. Um, da -da 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 -da. Okay. Never focus on your process, your pieces, your person, or the product. Okay, that's for everyone. Now, you, none of you guys have a clue what you're selling. That's the other big difference is you don't know the tangible outcome of what you're selling. Like, who was it that said to me, profit? Like, your profit is like your process. You know, what is your process? My process is basically, oh, we're going to get lots of cheat sheets and we're going to, uh, uh, you know, list this here and we're going to put a bit up a website and blah, blah, blah. No one cares. No one cares about your process. No one cares about my process. The pieces. Oh, well, you know, we've got seven videos and, and this, that and the other and blah, 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 and blah, blah, blah. Nobody cares. Oh, the person. Oh, I'm going to give you 10 hours a day of my time. And did you know I used to do marketing for the queen? No, no one cares. The product. Oh, my product is so no one cares about your product. Okay. The payoff. What is your payoff? Listen, you work with me. My payoff is very simple. A six figure online business. Typically within 90 days. Okay. That's my payoff. If you ever speak to me, all I'm, all I'm going to focus on is you're going to make, you're going to build a six figure business within 90 days. You're going to build a six-figure business within 90 days. I ain't going to tell you the process. I ain't going to tell you the pieces. I'm not going to focus on me. I'm not going to focus on the product. That's it. Um, that's it. Six-figure business within 90 days. That's my, and that's how you increase your conversions, guys and girls, all right? Anyway, I've got to keep it moving because uh, I'm kind of getting behind time. Um, and then we've got creating a high ticket offer and creating a content. So let me show you how this works. If you generate 100 leads a month, okay, and that's one thing that everyone does, or well, my clients anyway, and you have a very poor 10% conversion, and you sell something for a thousand pounds, you get 10 sales a month, you're going to get 10 grand a month, you've already got a six figure business, it ain't hard, you've done one thing out of the four, you're then going to increase more leads by doubling the amount of landing pages you've got and all the rest of it, you're going to have the same conversion rate, you're still selling at a thousand, you're going to have 20 sales, you've got 240,000 pounds a year business. Then you're going to focus on your payoff and your outcome, which is a six-figure online business within 90 days. And you're still going to generate 200 leads, but now you're going to double your conversion rate. And this is where it gets interesting. You're still selling at 1,000. I'm now getting 40 sales a month. I'm making half a million pounds a year from 200 people. You're then going to get 200 leads a month, same thing, and you're going to introduce a high-ticket offer. Now, 10% of these 40 are going to buy that high ticket offer. And that's not being super unrealistic, by the way. So that's my high ticket offer. Let's, for, for illustration purposes, is 10,000 pounds. Four people buy. That's another half a million. Then same 200 people, 10% of them are going to buy a 100 pound a month offer. That's 400 pounds per month. And all of that right, adds up to 80,000 pounds um, 964,000 pounds per year. In other words, the outcome and the result of you working with me is a million pound a year. A million pound a year is what you are going to get. And as long as your prospect believes that it's easy, it's possible, and they can do it, they're going to buy every single time. Every single time. So the keys to explode your business are 
Very, very simple. It is increase the number of leads per month, increase your conversion, create a high ticket offer and create a membership offer. And there is the maths, okay? It is not rocket science. The reason you guys are stuck is you can't even do the first thing. None of you can generate more than 15 leads. That's the biggest number I saw. That's why you're not rich yet, because you need help. You need professional help. All right, cool. So that's number, uh, number two. Now let's go into the success triangle. Now, this is, a th this is something that I created that you would have never, ever heard of. So this is really, really good. Success triangle. We all know what a triangle looks like, right? The first most important, well, the, the order of priority usually goes like this. A starving crowd, which is your market. What is a starving crowd? People with a pain point. People that need to get away from a pain or get towards a pleasure. Offer strength. How solid is your product or service? And the third thing is your sales and persuasion skills. And if you have a bad offer and you are bad at selling and persuasion, it does, you're still going to make money if you're in a great market. Let me demonstrate the process. If you have a kebab and burger stand outside a night, nightclub, you are going to sell out every single night because you're going to get a bunch of drunk, hungry customers, aka starving crowd coming out and they're going to buy your kebab and burgers even if it's the worst kebab burgers in the world, even if you're the worst salesman or woman in the world, they are going to buy it. What does that mean? It means that your market strength has to be in the right position. So let me tell you this. If you were in the desert and there was a, a, a bunch of people in the desert that all needed water, it doesn't, and they all had money. Let's just imagine they all had money, but one thing they have never had is nothing else. You could sell them toilet water. You can sell them water out of a toilet and they would still buy it. What does that mean? Your product can be terrible, but as long as your market, your audience is a starving crowd, you are gonna make money. Like, is this making sense, guys and girls? Let me know in the chat. Is this making sense? Okay, so is this making sense? So look, you haven't gotta be good at selling, okay? Your sales and persuasion skills don't matter, okay? Your sales and persuasion skills don't matter whatsoever because, look, if you're trying to sell to a crowd that's not very hungry, that's not in a lot of pain, well, you're going to struggle, okay? If you're trying to sell to people that are super comfortable, well, you're going to struggle, okay? And if your offer, like you, uh, well, everyone's offer on here is not good. I already know that because none of you can even tell me what you do. You don't have an outcome. You don't, you don't, like, this is terrible. So you're relying on being, you're in a bad market, you're, you've got a bad product or service and your sales and persuasion skills. Are, you better be like the wolf of Wall Street, you know, at selling. Otherwise, you're going to struggle. You see, but you can be the worst salesperson in the world. As long as your market is hungry, you have a, a decent offer, it, you're still going to make money. As I said, you've got to create a scenario where you have that burger van outside a nightclub and everyone is going to buy. You see, this is what you guys are doing. You're trying to sell, okay? Oh, this one is what I want. You're trying to sell a fitness course to fit people who aren't overweight, obese, and fat, and about to die with diabetes. That's the people you got to sell to. That's the starving market. You ain't selling to people that desperately want to leave their day job because they hate it so much there. They can't bear the thought of a rush hour journey one more time. And buying your thousand pound course is what they need. Like it's do or die. You're selling people who are in a comfort zone that it's like, well, it would be nice to have, but I don't know. But in addition to that, you're selling them junk. Well, it's not even junk. No, no, no. It's not junk. The thing is, you can't describe what it is. It's a, it's a commodity product. Oh, I sell digital marketing. Oh, I sell, you know, a fitness course. Well, so does a million other people. That's the problem. So the offer triangle or the success triangle, sorry, is very simple. Find a starving crowd. Find people that desperately need to lose weight. Find people that need to lose weight because they can't play with their kids. They can't walk to the park because they run out of breath. They can't bear the thought of their boss screaming at them one more time. Those are the kind of people that are going to buy your stuff. They can't, people who are single and they can't bear another lonely night in bed alone. Those, that is a starving market, okay? 
So uh, Penelope's got a good point. If you want a flat tummy easily after having a baby without causing injury. Yeah, I do, please. Can I have that? Um, <laughs> and then look, if you have a decent product, it doesn't have to be the best. It just doesn't have to be the worst. And you can be bad at sales. You're still going to make money. Okay, so remember one thing. People are always moving in two directions. They're either moving away from the pain of not having a flat stomach, of not having enough money, of being stuck on a rush hour every day, of, of being single or lonely or whatever it is, or they're moving towards a pleasure. Like they're moving towards some kind of pleasure. Now, next, next little lesson for you is riches are in the niches or niches. So I'm going to show you how I am going to take pretty much the same product and increase the value and the price of that product by 10 times. Time management. If I have a time management course, I can maybe sell that for 20 quid because, you know, yeah, it'll help me save a bit of time, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Time management, 19 pounds. But if I take the same course and rebrand it to time management for sales professionals, I can sell it for 100 pounds. Why? Because sales professionals value their time a lot more than the ordinary person because they have sales to make. I'm going to go one step further. I'm going to do time management for estate agents in sales. I'm going to sell it for 500. Why? Because if an estate agent can manage their time and generate at least one extra sale, they, they can, they, their time is more valuable than you know, the person on the street. So I can charge them a lot more for the same product. But I'm not going to stop there. I'm going to go one step further. Time management for high-end million plus luxury estate agents in sales. And their commission on that is thousands upon thousands. And that product costs 1997. Why? Because I know that if they can manage their time better and just help them land one more deal, that product would have paid itself. But they're not going to buy a time management product for 19 pounds because it doesn't speak to them. Like if you are you know, in, in, in the million pound sales category of estate agents, you believe this product is made for you. You believe it, even though it's pretty much the same as this one down here. But if it speaks to you and the messaging speaks to you, you believe it's for you. Therefore, it's like, wow, there is no other product in the market like it. This must be for me. See, all of you guys up here, this is you. You're selling social media. You're selling digital marketing. You're selling SEO, whatever you're selling, you're selling stuff that is basically at this level up here, niche down. Okay. We basically just took the same product and adapted the language specific to that avatar. And the product is virtually the same, but we just 100x our price. All right. That's a little lesson for you as a bonus. The riches are in the niches. All right. Secret number five Who here wants to live like a millionaire without having a million pounds in the bank? Give me a yes in the chat if that's you. Again, I want at least 50 entries. Otherwise, we're going to skip the secret completely. All right. Do you want to live like a millionaire without having a million pounds on the bank? And I'm very, very serious here, by the way. This isn't some fluff or nonsense. Come on. I want everybody to play along. Do you want to live like a millionaire without... Having a million pounds in a bank. Okay, Anthony says no. Anthony, why is that? Uh, be better with the cash too. Listen, yeah, yeah, listen. You'll become a millionaire. The money will come. Um, come on, we want at least 50 entries. Let me just have a look. Come on, guys and girls, for those of you that haven't done it yet, we haven't, oh, here we go, here we go. Oh, no, we're from here. So, no, we need more. Come on, guys, we need more. More entries, give me a yes, a love heart, a thumbs up or something. Who wants to live like a millionaire without having a million pound in the bank? Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes. Yes. Amazing. Amazing. All right. Cool. So I think we're there or thereabouts now. And can I just ask one question, right? So we've got over 100 people on here, but we're not, we don't have 100 comments. For the people that aren't commenting, right? And the people that aren't typing anything in the chat. What is your reason for that? I'm just curious. Like, why don't you want to participate in something that's going to help you? I'm just curious. Like, you can be as honest with you. You can say, Stas, I think you're a dick. You can say, Stas, I think you're, you're, full, of, you're full of BS. Stas, I think you're, you're annoying. I don't mind. Like, I'm just curious. Like, for the people that aren't participating in the chat, why aren't you participating in the chat? I'm just curious. Like, I really, really am. 
<laughs> okay. Well, but okay. Well, how do you know number one there's an offer coming? Um, somebody says they are scared of looking stupid, maybe with their devices, probably asleep. Yeah, listen, I, I have a tendency to put people to sleep. Playing catch up, sorry, very late. That's okay. No problem. No problem. Look, don't be afraid of looking stupid. Okay. I have made myself look so stupid so many times, it doesn't even bother me no more. And remember this quote, guys and girls, get comfortable being uncomfortable. Get comfortable being uncomfortable. And I promise you, you are going to grow faster than you've ever grown before. Okay, so get out your comfort zone. Even if you're not comfortable typing stuff in the chat, just do it. It's okay. Uh, somebody says my Zoom is unstable every time I press a key will cut out. Okay, no, no, no. that's a genuine excuse. Uh, by the way, listen, you might have um, uh, uh, you might have uh, a genuine reason, like your tech. That's fine. Okay, cool. All right, so let me teach you how you can live like a millionaire without having a million pounds in the bank. So. I want you to answer this question. At the rate you are saving money right now, how long will it take you to save a million pounds? Let me know. At the rate you are saving money right now, how long will it take you to save a million pounds? Come on. We've got a couple of them. Never, never. Well after I'm dead. Keep going. Keep 100 years. Keep going. Keep going. So let's have a few more entries. At the rate you are... Hey, look, if you're not saving, that's fine. Not saving. Two lives. 10 years. Longer than I'll probably be alive. No chance, never. 50 years at least, blah, blah, blah. Uh, I'm, I'm not mortal. <laughs> Need to become oldest human on the planet. <laughs> oh, I love it. Susan, you get the winning entry. 3,021. <laughs> Longer, 20 years, 100 years, 15 years, not in cash, maybe assets. All right, cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, so... What savings? Never, not sure. Okay, so let me give you some maths. If you save £100 a month, it will take you 833 years. If you save £1,000 a month, 83 years. If you save 10... Can anybody here save 10 grand a month, by the way? Can anybody here save 10 grand a month? Because um, it will only take you 8.3 years. But listen, you get there quick. By 2030. Oh my gosh, can you imagine? By 2030, you'll have a million pounds. Woohoo! I don't know about you, but I don't want to wait eight years to live um, a millionaire's lifestyle. So let me uh, show you something. A million pounds, if you inherited a million pounds, if I gave you a million pounds today, you, and if you went and bought a coffee with that, you would no longer be a millionaire. You would be a 999er, 999er, 999er heir, right? So the smart thing to do, okay, Oh, no, this is, this is tax-free money, Christine, okay? Just imagine this is tax-free money. I'm giving you a million pounds. The small thing to do with that million would be to invest it, and you can get investment at 6%, easy. 6% is nothing, okay? I'm not being unrealistic here, guys. 6%, so you take, you take the million that I give you that you inherit from a long-lost relative or whatever, you invest it at 6%, you will make 60 grand a year, 5,000 pounds per month, passive income okay passive income you take a million you invest at six percent you're going to get 60 grand a year five thousand pounds per month passive income so you don't have to get out of bed now surely then a, 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 if you could make five grand a month passively you could live the millionaire lifestyle right yeah so instead of having a million as long as i can make five grand a month passive I can still live like a millionaire because it's the same thing, right? It's the same thing. So the formula is very simple. You make, a, you make five grand a month passive, you can live the millionaire lifestyle, which is, look, I have something what I call the Digital Millionaire Club. And it's for my members only. The, the entry fee is 5,000 pounds. If you want to gain entry to it, send me an email, ping me a DM in my, in my uh, uh, Facebook or my Instagram We'll get you on it. It's five thousand pounds. Okay. How does the Digital Millionaire Club work? Well, we're very, very, very simply. We have two products. Okay. This is designed to make you live like a millionaire on the way to becoming one. So the first one we have a Digital Business Academy, which is a free trial for fourteen days, and then it's twenty, and then it's twenty-seven ninety-nine a month plus VAT. 
my members get 72% commission on that, which works out roughly 20 pounds a month to them net profit. If you get 100 people, you make two grand a month passive. If you get 250 people, you make five grand a month passive. Five grand a month passive income, which by the way, all the marketing, all the sales videos, all the sales pages, all the delivery, all the customer support is fulfilled for you by my company. Just so you know, we don't make any money off of this product. This product purely exists for my members only that are part of the Digital Millionaire Club to get them to live the millionaire lifestyle without having a million pounds in the bank. Then what we do is I give them another product. This is a, a very successful challenge that we did. It costs 100 pounds. They get 72% commission on that as well. If they get half of these people to buy the challenge, that's an additional just under three and a half thousand pounds. But if they're on this level, that's 125 people, they make 8,625. So you can see how very quickly people are able to make two, 5,000 pounds a month passive and have a massive cash injection um, you know, by offering other products and they do none of the work. None of the work, okay? Absolutely zero. So that is the Digital Millionaire Club. So look, if you want to live like a millionaire, all you got to do is find a way to make five grand a month passive. We've got many, many vehicles that you can do this as part of the Digital Millionaire Club. As I said, if you want to get into that, ping me a DM, uh, send me an email, but the fee is 5,000 pounds, okay? And everything is there. By the way, they ha I have email sequences set up, everything set up. So all you got to do, oh, let me ask you this question. Do you guys think you can get people to watch a free video and sign up for a free 14-day trial? Who can get people to watch a free video and sign up for a free 14-day trial? Say, say, I can in the chat or me or something like that. Who can get people to sign up for a free trial um, and watch a free video? Come on, like every one of you can do this, okay? Every single one of you can do this. Like you, you just can. Like if you can't do that, then you should probably stop. Come on, let's keep playing. Let's keep playing. Let's keep playing. Do, 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 do. All right. Okay, cool. So, all right. Excellent. Excellent. Good. So there you go. So you can all do it. Guys, I have a question for you. Okay. Let me just recap what we've covered. So we have covered how to achieve more in 30 days in the last 12 months, becoming clear on your offer, four keys to explode your business, success triangle, and how to live the millionaire lifestyle without living money in the bank. Now, let me ask you a question. Would you like to try and make this happen alone? Or that's option one or option two, who would want step-by-step -step help and guidance from me and the proven path I've used to generate over a million pound in sales over the last 12 months alone? So option one or option two, guys, option one or option two, um, option one or option two, somebody says me ASAP. Okay. Love it. Look, for those of you that comment, I'm going to send you a private message in a minute with a private, what we're gonna do, I'll tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna have a private session with the people that are serious about this. So if you're option two, I'm gonna send you a private link. We're gonna close this Zoom down and we're gonna open up the other Zoom session that I've got prepared for the people that are serious. So if you don't comment, you're not even gonna find out what I can do for you. So that's how we work, all right? And that's okay, look, I still love you. You're still my friend, it's all good. It's all good. All good. All right. Excellent, excellent. So we've got a few entries. Good. So look, if you are serious about this, so option two people, I have dedicated a month. For the next month, I've dedicated my time, my team's time, okay, to work with a small group of people. So if you want to be part of that small group of people, let me know. Uh, just put two or option two in the chat, and I'm about to send you guys a link to a special breakout room. Now, this is for you. Again, if you want results, you've had enough of trial and error, you're struggling on your own, you don't know where to start, you're committed to taking action and investing in yourself, you want to create financial stability, you want to get your lifetime and flexibility back, 
if your ads accounts are restricted and you want a pandemic proof income. And this works for any digital product you can think of. Online courses, eBooks, affiliate products and services, coaching programs, masterminds, software tools, marketing service and done for you. Any digital marketing. Now, remember, everything you guys are trying to do is a test. I have taken this test a thousand times. What's more important, time or money, okay? Which one do you guys want to be, all right? And remember, I think I can help. Like 10K in 30 days, look at the awards we've won. Look at the screenshots that I'm showing you guys. And like a lot of these are, look, from October, like this was just the other, just the other, just the other week. You know, this is just last 30 days. Look, it's just, just crazy. And there you go, okay? So this stuff actually works. So for the option two people, Bear with me a second. I'm going to send you a special. It doesn't matter if you're new, by the way. So, Laura, if you're new to business, listen, you, you need this more than the other more than the other people, I would say so. So uh, let me just get my link. Bear me a second. Uh, I'm going to get my link and then I'm going to paste it because, look, hopefully this session has been useful for you. OK. Um, I am now going to wrap this up and I'm going to do a special session for the offer two. So join me here. There you go. There's the link. Okay. If you guys want to click on that link and join me on that session, then um, look, I'm going to end this session now, though. Uh, so thank you very much for attending. Thank you very much for um you know coming hopefully it's been useful look if you are serious i'm doing a special session um there's the link once again um there you go and this is for people who want to work i'm only looking for you know a small group i'm going to tell you all the details on that link go to that link right now thank you very much uh all went to a terrific session amigo you're very welcome amigo and look all the people that are option two if you want help and you're serious about getting this done Please go to that link in the chat right now. I am going to enter. Um, I'm going to start that in a moment, and then we're going to go. For those of you who are looking to follow me, please join our Facebook communities as well. So here is our Facebook community. Uh, give me a follow on Instagram uh, as well. Um, and give me a subscribe to my youtube channel i'd really appreciate it i put out a lot of amazing free content thank you very much for the people that are still here hopefully it has been useful there are my so join the facebook group follow me on instagram and also uh follow uh, subscribe to my youtube channel but for everyone else uh let's go to a special training session and here it is the special training session link is where is it let me just get the link again all right guys and girls go to that link go to link now and i will see you there all right i will see you there uh thank you very much for coming guys and girls um, I will see you at that special link. Uh, if you are serious and if you want to work with me over the next 30 days, I'll tell you everything. It's going to cost you probably as much as a cost of coffee a day. That's how much it's going to cost you. Okay. So I will see you on that special link. Mm -hmm.